live streaming a deadly crash and the aftermath showing her sister's lifeless body will remain in jail for now after a judge today declined to reduce her bail. 18-year-old Abdulia Sanchez is accused of killing her 14-year-old sister one week ago near Los Banos. With tissue in her hand and at times tears streaming down her face, Abdulia Sanchez stood in front of a Merced County judge asking to either be released or have her bail reduced from $560,000. I did speak with uh, Ms. Sanchez at length yesterday about what to expect today and quite frankly this is what we expected to happen. Based on the serious nature of the charges and a prior reckless driving offense, the judge refused to lower it. Attorney Romnick Samrau believes the bail amount is expected excessive considering she spent the past few years in foster care and has been living in a group home. There is the Eighth Amendment to the Constitution which says uh, no excessive bill shall be required. I think this bill is excessive for her. Outside court, Abdulia's father briefly commented in Spanish. Whatever's going to come out will come out, he said. The public defender isn't focusing on the court of public opinion. He says the ones who matter are understanding. The families behind her being released um, they're not mad at her. They don't blame her. The surviving passenger, um, Manuela, made a public statement that she's not mad at her. She's not afraid of her. The district attorney said the bail schedule is set strictly according to charges, and this case was no different. He wants Abdulia to stay in jail. Well, I think that was the appropriate action. I think the bail should remain where it's set. As he gets to know his client, Sam Rao said he's learned more about Abdulia's personality and the culture she was raised in. He said that experience explain the lingo in the live stream video seen across the nation. But he says the video was stopped between the deadly crash and then streaming of Jacqueline's still body. In that break is when she's on the phone with 911, when she's trying to flag down people on the road who are not stopping for her.